Somebody said I'm giving a bit too much away, actually, at the moment. Never you always do. You give until it hurts. <laughs> I'm going to go along and uh, meet my friend Julian, because he's here to talk to me today, and he's wearing a rather nice coat. Hello. Oh, hello. Are you dressed as Rupert <laughs> Bear today? I'm wearing a tartan trouser. Capreet, have you met my friend Julian? No, but I feel like I have, because you talk about him so much. This is my, um, my producer. And who was the one that met us at the door? Oh, that was Jess. Is she a producer? She's an assistant producer. Yes, she... see. Why? Just like a rock chick. <laughs> <laughs> Come here, Jess. Is she making you a cup of tea? She's making me a cup of tea. You're dressed like a rock chick, he says. Rock chick? Yes. I'll take that. See, these two know all about YouTube. What do you think about me starting this YouTube channel? I'm gripped. I've been oh. watching the one where you're all miserable because you, I, I went you're past on your George. own. And then you told us you sunbathed topless in the window. I, I know. enjoyed that. Somebody said I'm giving a bit too much away, actually, at the moment. Never you always do. You give until it hurts. <laughs> oh, here comes a rock chick with the unfeasibly snug trousers. She's got an amazing voice. Yeah. Who have you brought with you? Oh, take no notes of him. He's a publicist. <laughs> what was that? His name is Paul something or other. Thank you, you so much. Jess, am I doing this properly? Um, well, you're using you're using a tripod, actually. These young people, a... <laughs> Julia. They know everything. I love your coat, <laughs> seriously. Look at this, everyone. <laughs> Thank you. That is so really young. nice. Right, we're going to go through in a moment. My team will just sit you down. This will go out Sunday week. Lovely. 11 o'clock on a well, Sunday. This will be a more cheerful episode, yes. will it? <laughs> <laughs> Sit down and don't be nervous. Okay. So tonight I'm in a bit of a quandary because I've been asked as a lie, I offered to introduce one of my favourite bands, Police Dog Hogan, to introduce them on stage at Scala in King's Cross. Now, um, I don't know how to introduce a band. I've only done it once before. It wasn't successful. That was with Van Morrison. And I don't know what to wear. Someone, my team said, I wear jeans and a rock t-shirt. I don't have a rock t-shirt. So I am wearing my skinny jeans. In fact, if I do this, there, you can see skinny jeans, uh, a leather thing. And then I'm wearing this coat that everyone hates apart from me because I look a bit like Cousin It from the Adams Family. Have a look. I mean, that's all right, isn't it? It's cold. So, uh, heroin chic. That's what I'm going for, heroin chic. See you later, Matilda. Bye. Do you know, actually, I'd actually prefer to be here. <laughs>
weather, we've uh, come down by train. Come on, Matilda. We're, uh, we've come to where I grew up to see my mum, who's 93, and we try to get down as often as we can. And this is a little market town in Sussex. It's very quiet. Come on, Matilda. It's quite nice to actually have some fresh air, but it's, uh, it is very quiet. Come on, come on. Keep walking, keep walking. Matilda, we're in the country. In the country. In the country. This is our bandstand in Horsham. This is Saturday afternoon entertainment. I guess they need a bit longer to set up. I'll go and get some sausages. Hello. Hi. <laughs> what a surprise. <gasps> oh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Just listen, this is PJ. PJ, I'm coming around quick here. Car, quick car. This is one of the big successes of this town, a huge success. Where did we meet? <gasps> Brighton. And what were you doing in Brighton I in those days? I was coming out of the closet, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> and my she... dog was eating your microphone and she... your porridge. Her dog was eating my muff and had <laughs> just come out. Literally, she'd come out the closet. And now, look at you are one of the most successful entrepreneurs. Oh. We need to show everyone this. Oh. Oh. This is a reason, truly, to come to Portion. This is amazing. Was this always your dream? No. No, not at all. No, no. Morning. Morning. Hello. Forgive us. Hello. I'm just filming this celebrity. It's a huge Marianne, success. Marion, are you great? So there's lovely gentlemen here. Hello. 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 Um, no, no, we never thought we'd open a shop. We used to run the market, so we were into local produce. Um, and that sort of led to, well, we know that people are into local produce and really fine food and good quality. And provenance. It's all about provenance, where it's all come from. So from running that sort of shop came, and then a year off the shop, this will go back five years now, that unit became available and people kept saying, well, you sell coffee beans, you might as well sell coffee. So then the coffee shop happened. But no, never a dream, Joe. But look at it. I mean, these girls, seriously, they work so hard. I know from when I used to waitress. You know, if you want to make a success of somewhere, you've just got to keep going. And this is open almost seven days a week. You are closed on Sunday, a Sunday. Sunday. On a Sunday. Sunday. Close You're one day off. I have to go to church. And no, we're... She goes to church, of course. It's the it's the Sabbath. It is. It's so you'll always Sunday find this. Church. But listen, PJ, I, honestly, every time I come past, I always say to my mum, we must come in and have a coffee. She's a... Uh, 93 and the weather means she's staying at home at the moment but were you open all through that weather yes absolutely and and you know these poor people that couldn't get to the i won't mention supermarkets no but, no you know of course you know it's like oh you sell vegetables and you don't sell them in plastic yeah i know and w coffee was still going everything was still going and we we timed our deliveries because we didn't want our guys coming out when it's really bad but it all worked perfectly and this place when i was at school i used to walk past here and do my makeup there was a little mirror there i do my makeup on the way to horsham high school for girls would you believe so it's so lovely to know that someone very special is occupying we went this to the same school. school. We did go. Yeah. To the same. Look how well we've done. I know. Verona Hill for us. She's that is much better than I no, have. No, I haven't. Much the school us. motto: nothing is truer than truth, which is true, PJ. Go, go, Horsham High School. <laughs> So I've just been to Horsham and I've had my eyebrows tinted because it's cheaper having them done in Horsham, but I, they're quite ferocious. Um, my mother finds this hysterical. What do you think? Well, I think it looks rather funny to tell you the truth. You look like these girls that are all made up for the stage or something. It is going to fade, is it? Are they going to fade? What are you reading? I'm reading Fern's book. Fern, Fern Britain, Coming Home. It's her latest book. Really good. It's Guy! This is my mum's garden. Should we do some gardening? Should we do some gardening then? Come on then, let's do some gardening. Hey, Matilda, you're stone cold crazy. Hey. Bye then, Matilda, I'm off now. You coming? You coming? Bye! Bye. <laughs> yeah, see, she thinks you've really gone. No, she won't do anything. I'm now going, but you she won't actually do anything. Normally. Bye. She couldn't care less. She really couldn't care. This is a silly experiment. Come on then, Tilda, we're going now. She just won't move more. No, there's a good girl. You go, you come back next week. She doesn't want to leave Woody. You come back next week. Come on, we'll see Woody next week. We're going yeah. now. Why are you looking? <laughs> I can't do anything about it. <laughs> oh. 
Come on, we're going now. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Come along. Journey back. Back to London. Come on, Tild. Tilda, come on. Come on. Come on, Tild. She won't come. Please, come on. Come on, we got to go. Come on, Tild. You know, you... come on, oh, you've got a lovely life waiting at home. Oh, poor on the Tilda. Good girl. girl. There's a good girl. What's Talk about reluctant. Girl. Yeah, clever girl. There's a good girl. See you next week. Yeah, you come back next week. There's a good girl. There we are. Come Up on. We go. Come on. Oh, she just won't. Come on, Tilde. It's a long journey. You'll never get there at this start. <laughs> oh, quick. <laughs> right. <laughs>